Dan Williams, Survive Outdoors. If you're new to the channel, we do wilderness medicine uh, videos, uh, some gear reviews, uh, preparing you if you get injured in the outdoors, what to avoid in the outdoors, talk about a lot about zoonosis, Lyme disease, spider bites, you name it. So along with our poison ivy series here, uh, this is going to be a brief video on how long does the poison ivy rash last? A lot of questions about that. Uh, I know, I said I was going to do treatment. That is our end video, which will be coming up in the next week or two. So how long does the poison ivy rash last? <clears throat> Excuse me, you're going to hear things from me like, for the most part, generally, because there really are no absolutes in medicine, or should I say very few absolute truths. One of those is shingles is always on one side of the body. Now that's true. So the poison ivy rash from the oil, the Urushiol oil, usually lasts on average about two weeks, three weeks at the max. And if you do nothing at all, avoid scratching it, and just treat the itch, then that rash should dissipate in about two weeks. Now this is dependent on a lot of factors. It's dependent on how allergic are you, how severe the rash is, <clears throat> how extensive did you get into it. There's also a few caveats here that you really need to be aware of. The oil from that plant can stay on tools like axes, hose, guns, uh, bows for up to five years. Up to five years. If it's not thoroughly cleaned and washed. That is the truth and maybe even longer. But what they've researched and found out it's up to five years. So if you're walking through the woods, you have your gun barrel and you move some weeds from one side to the other, that's right on your gun barrel. You bring it in, you clean it, and you're gonna get the poison ivy. Um, I've had patients come in in late February, haven't been out in the woods in three months, and they have poison ivy, where'd they get it? I said, did you move your boots or any of your clothes, any of your implements? Oh yeah, I cleaned up my hunting area and my boots, I moved those, there you go. So they're hiking boots, they had the poison ivy on their boots. So that's an important caveat to know because that'll help you determining where this came from and a secondary um, sensitivity to where you're gonna get it from some other avenue, like your boots or your gun or wherever. So the, on average, it's gonna last about two to three weeks. You can decrease that with treatment. Clearly with prescription drugs, you can decrease that with. And you definitely can help the itch with over-the-counter antihistamines, which we are going to delve into into the last video in depth. We're gonna be talking about over-the-counter as well as prescription meds and what works, what doesn't work, and what you should be careful with and to avoid. All right, guys, that was my brief video today. Keep your eyes on the horizon, your face to the wind. We'll see you next time.